I have a very quick tutorial for you today. Most of you probably already know that the min function in Excel is going to return the minimum value in a list. When you type in the min function, it looks for your sequence of numbers and we can select our sequence of data and hit enter and we can see our minimum value comes up as 15,056. And our max will return the maximum value in a list. So again, we can select all of our values and our maximum value comes up very easy. Now we can check these values. If I quickly turn on my filter and I filter my values, we can see here in our filter because it goes in ascending order. So our lowest value is 15,056, which matches our minimum value. And our highest value is 34,903, which also matches. But what if you wanted to get the fifth smallest or the tenth smallest or the second smallest value? Well, in this case, you would use the small function. And the small function returns the nth smallest value in a data set. So we can just select our data set as we did with our min and with our max. And then it's looking for what number. So let's say we want our fourth smallest number and hit enter. And what it's now returned back is the fourth smallest number from our data set. Let's say we wanted the second largest. Well, then we'd select the large function. We would take our array of data. And we would select two because we're looking for the second largest function. And we can see it's 34,877. Now let's check these values. We can see here one, two, three, four. Our fourth smallest value is 15,513. And our second largest value is 34,877. Now you can use these formulas, min, max, small and large, within other formulas such as a lookup formula. So you're not constrained to just using these formulas in isolation like that. So that's a very quick tutorial for you on min, max, small and large. If you found it useful, I hope you will give it the thumbs up. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And please do drop any comments that you have in the comments box below. Hi, my name is Paula and thanks for watching. Here at the Excel Club, I offer online Excel and Power BI courses for all levels. We have free courses to get you started and premium courses on more advanced and specialised Excel and Power BI training. You can access these courses on the website and from our apps and there's links below the video. So please do explore them. We also offer custom Power BI and Excel solutions. So if you want to create custom financial models or a Power BI dashboard, then I can help you. You can find contact details also on the website. If you haven't already, I hope that you'll take the time now to give this video the thumbs up, like and subscribe. Don't be shy. Feel free to comment below and say hi. See you next time. Bye now.